ஹலோ வணக்கம் நான் உங்கள் அன்பு தமிழன் மெக்சிகோவில் இருந்து இன்றைக்கி நம்ம ஒரு இன்ட்ரெஸ்டிங்கான பர்சனை மீட் பண்ண போகிறோம் இவங்க வந்து ஷீ இஸ் அண்ட் உமன் ஆண்டர்பிரனர் என்னடா விமன் ஆண்டர்பிரனரில் ஒரு டிஃப்ரென்ஸ் அப்படின்னு நீங்கள் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா நம்ம நிறைய விமன் ஆண்டர்பிரனர்ஸ் பார்த்துருப்போம் எய்தர் தே வில் பி இன் டு த ஃபுட் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி ஆர் காஸ்மெட்டிக் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி ஆர் சம்திங் ரிலேட்டட் டு ஸ்பா ஆர் பியூட்டிஷன் ரிலேட்டட் திங்ஸ் பட் திஸ் இஸ் த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டைம் ஐ எம் மீட்டிங் அண்ட் டெக்கி ஆண்டர்பிரனர் she is the owner of uh, gdl iphone repair hello uh, i met her in uh, one of a critical situation where my iphone had a trouble and she is uh, really a nice person she helped me to recover all my data from the iphone let's meet uh, windy and we have lot of questions to ask hi windy hi how are you how are you bien gracias how are you i'm good i'm good uh, first of all i wanted to ask you uh, like uh, why you were chosen this uh, technical field because Uh, normally uh, when we look at uh, different uh, people uh, particularly a uh, women entrepreneur if they wanted to get into a business they go something related to women or beauty or food industry right mm-hmm. why did you choose this technical field actually it was like a kind of an opportunity mm-hmm. because i'm i'm a graphic designer oh okay okay i have a degree on, on graphic designer and but i actually didn't have a knife on before i started working here okay so when i started working here i i was um just a little um i don't want to to repair icons i don't want to and then i fell in love with this job ah, okay. because actually it's uh, for me it's amazing how to open an iphone how to repair it how to fix it and actually how to help people because uh your iphone or your phone your cell phone is mm-hmm. it's almost like a part of you Uh, when did you start this uh, GDL iPhone repair? Uh it's um almost like 2 years ago. Mm-hmm. I have been working here like 2 years ago and this is uh like a part of another uh business. Okay. That it's uh in the United States. We have a uh, over there we have two stores. Okay. And we well, like two or three stores and here we have this store. Okay. Yeah, so but here we have like 2 years. Uh-huh. 2 okay. years and so how uh, how was your feeling uh, when you open a first iphone like when you this is the first time you are seeing it the internal parts like how did you feel about it when i opened an iphone yes okay uh, i think um it's amazing actually because the first time that i opened an iphone i was like uh, just practicing i was learning how to repair an iphone and um and it was amazing because i realized that it's not that uh, complicated to fix it so what are all the services you give here like uh, you do everything related to apple products or just only iphone just iphone and uh we fix the crystals of the ipad okay because the iphone uh we can fix uh, since the iphone 5 to the iphone 11 pro max mm-hmm. and the the iphone 12 and and the newer mm-hmm. we can fix it and uh, get because we don't have the parts uh with the quality that we we'll, we would like to to have okay. you know and about the iPad we just fix the crystal we can fix actual actually uh to the batteries and the charging port okay. but it's a little more complicated because when you open an iPad uh they don't have the screws oh just okay use the iPhone okay. on the iPad the crystal is with blue oh okay, okay. so okay. when you ha- when you want to open it uh it wa it wa uh, it's going to break okay yeah. so in a iphone uh, when uh, for example if somebody comes with an uh, iphone uh, the panel is broken or the crystal is broken uh, do you change just this cr- crystal or you change uh, the underneath the display also like uh, what is the difference it's a complete piece because so the crystal it's the crystal and the display it's a, it's a one piece it's one piece okay you cannot separate it or Actually you can separate there is some uh, some uh, places when you can just uh replace the crystal mm-hmm. right and recommend it because okay. uh when they replace the crystal maybe you can uh damage the display too. Ah okay. Yeah because it's a lot of of heat that you need and everything. Okay. So no I I replace all the pieces and I and I think it's the best choice. Okay. Yeah. I think uh, all the iPhone or the Apple product users have this trouble you know the charging cable right like it will not last longer and sometimes the uh, the outer portion of the cable will uh, rip off and sometimes it will break 
So, uh, what is your suggestion? You still have the same problem, or uh, you have any? With the cables? Yeah. That is still broken every time? Y yeah. So, yeah. you have any suggestions, or you also face the same problem? No, it's the same problem. I think the cables is the worst thing that Apple has. <laughs> you know? Yeah. It, uh, they always broke, it's uh, broken every time, but um, about the, uh, all the devices, I think it's, it's the best for me. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, regarding the charging rate, what is your recommendation? Because I've uh, recently I've seen, uh, I've changed like two, three phones. Um, every time the reason why I change the phone is because of the charging issue. Either uh, it does not charge properly or sometimes the battery drains off quickly. Mm -hmm. So what is your recommendation for uh, you, uh, particularly on the charging part? About the iPhone, I think it's just a, uh, uh, this thing, this issue. It's always um, been present on the iPhones about the battery that dies quickly. Mm -hmm. Okay, but uh, the normal iPhone, a battery on an iPhone, it's for uh, two years or two years and a half. Okay. When uh, when it's dead already, you have to replace this this battery. And it's important to say, I think it's important to say that and you don't gonna find any original parts uh, anywhere. Okay. No, just in Apple. Okay. Uh, even us, we don't have the original parts. Okay. We have our uh, original quality. Okay. But no, no, we don't have original parts because Apple doesn't doesn't sell the parts uh, outside the stores. Oh, they don't sell no. it. Okay. No, you have you have to find this this uh, parts when the quality that, that you want. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's Being right. so, a uh, women entrepreneur, uh, what is the uh, three challenges that you see? Like entrepreneur? Yes. Okay, I think the first thing that is as a competition, you know, here in, in Guadalajara, mm -hmm. we have a, a lot, but um, we, we have to learn how to manage uh, our social media. Okay. Because that's our principal tool. Okay. And we have like a, a big community on our, on our social media. So, okay. yeah, that's that's the first challenge, all the competition that we have in here. Mm -hmm. GDL, the other one, just for me, it's the, at the beginning, just to learn how to fix iPhones. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because I, I, Obviously. I, I thought that it was impossible for me. Okay. And actually, I have this, this uh, boundary uh, mm -hmm. with me, like, uh, you're a woman. You know, ah, you, okay. never, you never, you yeah. never so, you never work in something so technical. You know, you never uh, work. Uh, I, I used to know a lot of information about cars, mm -hmm. for example, but not mm -hmm. about iPhones. Okay. And when I, I took this iPhone the first time and, and, and opened it, I was so afraid because I, oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna damage this iPhone. Yeah, you know? like. And then I, I, I tried to, to, to train my people, mm -hmm. and they, uh, they have the same. Uh, um, they are afraid about it. Learn how to to run an a store ah, myself. Okay. You know, okay. like the admin, like the uh, uh, like social media, like the people, like how to to get my pieces from another country. You know, because okay. all my pieces come from the United States. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, it was uh, challenging, but I think it's uh, we we have been working well. Uh, when uh, when you talk about the batteries, right? If I come with a phone where I say that I have a problem with the battery, like how, what are the process that you do? You just change the battery or before changing the battery, you do some checks on my battery or that, on that, my that's phone battery. That's an battery. important question because uh, I can show you all the process that we, we have with when an iPhone comes to us. Okay. Because uh, the principal question that I, that I have to, to ask to, to my customer is what kind of iPhone do you, do you have? Okay. Because every model of iPhone has an issue. For okay. example, if, if, an I, if you bring me to me an iPhone success mm -hmm. and you say, hey, I have uh, some troubles with my battery. Uh, the second question is, did you change your, your battery before? Okay. And if you say yes, probably you have an issue on your motherboard. Oh, okay. And if you say no, it's just, maybe just gonna have a, a just gonna need a battery replacement. Okay. okay. But it's important to to know the model. It's important to know if you if you mm, fix your iPhone before. And one time that I have this information, I'm gonna make a diagnosis first. So maybe I can show you. Yeah. Okay. So um, I'm gonna show you how I analyze this iPhone since they come to mm -hmm. us. Okay. 
So the first thing that we have to, to do is to put it this in here. This is too hot and this is just to, to open the island because they have uh, they are water resistant, they are not waterproof. Okay. okay. So the heat is just to, to open it because they have this glue. Okay. And I have to, to open it. Uh, before we take off the screws, I already take off. The icon in the power supply that I told you mm -hmm. is this one, okay? Okay. So we have to turn it on. So this is this is uh, telling us that the icon is good. It's good. healthy and healthy, okay? okay. Every icon has a different voltage. Oh, uh, can you tell me um, what is the right process or a procedure to charge an iPhone? Like I can charge it anytime or is that a, what would be the best practices? Yeah, I, I think I, paid, I can give you a, a little advice about your iPhone. Uh, about the battery, uh, if you are um, charging it and you don't have it, 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 you don't have to charge, uh, to leave your, your iPhone charging all night because okay. we used to do that actually. Yes. We used to do that and it's so, uh, it's damaged your, mm -hmm. your, your battery, okay? Mm -hmm. And don't charge it on on the car. Okay. Okay, even uh, only if you have an emergency. Then yeah. you can charge. Yeah, the power banks. Yeah, power banks. Oh. Yeah, the power banks, uh, they, are, they can damage your, your iPhone too. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to tell you why because. Uh, on the car or, or the power bands, they're gonna give the actual voltage that it needs. Okay. The car it's, uh, it's too high the voltage, okay. and the power band is uh, unstable. Okay. Even in the car too. Okay. To charge the first time that you have your new battery, mm -hmm. you have to charge it from zero to one hundred. Okay. We don't use it. Okay. We should not use when it is on charge. Yeah. Once in six months, zero to hundred percent. Yeah. The remaining time, zero to ninety percent is fine. Yeah. Okay. And the principal thing, don't use that water. Many times. Even if it's important. <laughs> Hi viewers, uh, hope you liked this video. You would have got to know more about more information from this video. Spanish word for this video is reparación. That means repair. So reparación is the Spanish word for this video. Uh, Hi, if you now uh, we have got uh, mutton biryani from Jack's uh, Biryani Center. So Wendy is going to taste it and tell us how it is. Okay. It so this is this is an uh, uh, Indian food and we call it as biryani and this is made of chivo. Okay. It's mm. spicy. <laughs> you, you feel it spicy? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it, it has uh, like many uh, spices mixed together, particularly uh, ceboya, tomate, and ginger, garlic, we grind it all together and then yeah. we make it. It's a spicy even for me that I'm Mexican, <laughs> but because I, I don't I don't need so, so much uh, chili, you know? Yes. But it's it's great, I yeah. think it's yummy. Not the onion, but I, I think okay. the mix with the yogurt. It's, it's yeah, yogurt, yeah. <laughs> Actually, that helps in uh, digestion. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Mm. Now it would taste different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's kind of funny because um, it's not normal this mix is on, on here in Mexico, you know? Yeah. But um, it's right. Actually, it tastes good. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>